Just make sure you did it right. Oh, you checked in the back of the book. No, you said you got it right. So I said, how would you know you're right? So I'm saying you checked your answer in the back of the book. I didn't say you copied the answer. <laughs> so, but let's just go and take a look for the process to make sure. If you want to say, what is the point? What given point is at pi over 4? So the main important thing, ladies and gentlemen, is we need to know what our unit circle looks like, as well as what does the angle pi over 4 look like? So remember, pi over 4, to write it, draw an angle, we have to know what standard form is. Remember, standard form has our initial side. And then our terminal side is going to be the rotation of pi force wherever it's going to land. Now remember, halfway around the circle, we have described as a distance of pi. If I rotate my two angles halfway around a circle, then that would be pi. So if this is pi force, that means I'm only rotating it 1 fourth of pi. So that would be only from here to here, right? It's pi over 4. That's the rotation where that's the initial side. That's your terminal side. Remember, whenever you're going counterclockwise, that's in the positive direction. So to determine what that point is, we go into our unit circle. And the big thing that I'm really big on in this class is understanding what the first quadrant is, all the points on the unit circle in the first quadrant. Because if you can, if you can memorize the first quadrant, you can find the points for the whole rest of the quadrant. So this point is 1 comma 0. 0 comma 1. Square root of 3 over 2 comma 1 half. Square root of 2 over 2 comma square root of 2 over 2. 1 half comma square root of 3 over 2. This first one is for 30 degrees, 45 degrees, and this one's for 60 degrees. Well, 30 degrees, that relates to pi over 6. This relates to pi over 4. And this relates to pi over 3. So therefore, this angle is going to be the point square root of 2 over 2 comma square root of 2 over 2. So that's the point at pi over 4. All right. Cool.